Um, the story of how Kristen and Bryce first met is one of my favorite parts of their love story. One day, Kristen came home bragging about this cute boy she saw at the volleyball game. Um, she then made it her mission to find this boy again, and luckily for her, it was Halloween weekend. Um, at the end of the night, I ventured back home to see Kristen, a mermaid, and this random baseball player at the top of our stairs. And their love story continued from St. Louis to California to Florida and soon to Michigan. I didn't say that, but... Okay, wait, 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 I got it. Don't look at the camera. I got it. Oh, you do have it. The first moment I saw you, I couldn't take my eyes off you. When I finally had the opportunity to talk to you, it was ruined. I hoped I would get another chance to talk to you, but that never happened. So you can imagine my surprise when I realized it was you yelling, hey mermaid, from the porch on Halloween. I wasn't gonna let you get away again, even if that meant me putting my own number into your phone. Hey, mermaid! <laughs> it wasn't always obvious. It wasn't always easy to put up with me. But when I knew it was you, I knew. There's literally nobody else in this world that will ever fit me as well as you do. Somebody who can handle and match my oddness with equal amounts of oddness <laughs> and happiness and support me just when I need it. I promise, and this is my only promise, <laughs> I promise to keep you laughing our entire lives. I can't express my excitement, I literally can't find words, and I don't think words would justify it if I could, of how excited I am for the world that we're gonna explore together, the world we're gonna shape together, and the world that we're gonna build together. Thank you for taking me as your husband. Here we stand. From this day forward, I promise to support you in all your goals and aspirations and to forever be your mermaid.